All right, guys, so I'm going to show you how to skin a perch. Uh, right here, I got two nice, beautiful um, yellow perch. Caught these at Blue Lake in Sterling Forest today. This one weighed about 2 pounds, 2 ounces, and this one weighed about 1.9. Pretty nice sized perch. Let me show you all the smaller ones here, how to, how to fly them. Alright, so what you're going to do is basically just cut them right here right along the spine there and just use the tip of the knife to cut all the way back just in a little bit then once you get to about the edge of this fin right here you can actually just you can feel it, you can push it through then angle your knife down slightly this way it rides the bone all the way back along the tail. You get a nice piece of meat out of that. And then just slightly take this and slightly cut. You can actually feel the bone. I don't know if you guys can hear that. Sounds like a little vibration. And you just do that. And now what I do, because it's just so much easier, I just cut all this off. So. Jab that through. Save the meat. And yes, this does dull up your knife, but that's what knife sharpeners are for. Cut off this right here. Then all I do, actually no. Take your fingernail right here, and you're just gonna cut this down a little bit lightly to the skin, and you're just gonna ride the skin all the way back. just like this. Angle it down slightly against the skin so you can get every piece of meat off. And yes, this was a pregnant perch that was going to lay eggs in the spring. Nice cut just like that. Nice meatless piece of skin right here. And then all I do is I just find where the rib cage is here. I just cut that off. Now I'm sure that there's another way to do this where you can save more meat but this is just how I've done it my whole life so just like that you got your little piece of meat right here that's why you gotta get a whole lot make it worth it and then you just do the same thing to the other side so I hope this helps you out and thank you very much for watching